এবারে নির্বাচনে জনগণ যে আমাদের ভোট দিয়ে নির্বাচিত করেছে এবং আমাদের অনেক স্বতন্ত্র নির্বাচিত হয়েছে এবং অন্য দলগুলিও বেশ কিছু নির্বাচিত হয়েছে যা সম্পূর্ণ এদেশের মানুষ শত স্ফূর্তভাবে ভোট দিয়ে নির্বাচিত করেছে এবং নির্বাচনকে খুব সুষ্ঠুভাবে পরিচালনা করার সব ধরনের ব্যবস্থা আমরা নিয়েছি যেটা আপনারা নিজেরাই দেখেছেন এবং আমিও খুব আনন্দিত কারণ এই বিজয়টা হচ্ছে জনগণের বিজয় নির্বাচন যে অব্যাহত সুষ্ঠু নিরপেক্ষ হতে পারে সেই দৃষ্টান্তটাও আমরা সৃষ্টি করতে পেরেছি Madam Prime Minister, my name is Samira Hussain and I'm with the BBC. Do you believe that Bangladesh can be considered as having a vibrant democracy, especially with the absence of any opposition party? If any party does not participate in the election, it does not mean that there is no democracy. You have to consider whether people have participated or not. And you know that the, you mentioned the party. what they did they set fire they killed people through arsenal is it democracy yes we believe in democracy but when you try to kill common people just for your political i mean i, I don't know it is not political it is just a terrorist activities so no one should exercise their terrorist activities in the country people don't accept it people's participation is main objectives main thing so the election took place they couldn't stop it they tried their best to do it but they didn't So how do you define that? More than 3,000 people burned down, 500 were killed, and still people are suffering in the hospital. So how do you define that they are democratic party? They are terrorist party. It is terrorist activities. People didn't really support it. And to celebrate your victory, would you consider granting pardon to people like Muhammad Yunus. Thank you. Look, it is the labor court. Yunus, the people belongs to his own company. They were deprived. They filed a case and the labor court. He violated the labor law or deprived the, his own employee. So they filed the case and from that they got this judgment so i have nothing to do with that so the question of pardoning him does not come to me rather he should ask his own employee and he should seek pardon to the labor <laughs> only i can say.